Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So quickly do the old spill, uh, I apologise. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. Leave me a comment down below what you think of this week's first idea. And also if you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. So yes, so this week's spares idea is we are gonna something simple something that um, a lot of you've got you've all got different colors of everything you've got different sizes of these so this week's spares idea is we're going to be decorating our trays i just thought you know most of us have these they're all one color and everything unless you pay somebody to do yourself a nice resin one and everything but me i love these ones you know these are the ones i use all the time and um yeah, these are just my go-to ones. I love these large trays. They're a lot bigger than like the little green boats or the normal white trays that quite often kits come with. So yeah, this is a lot bigger as you can see compared to my hand. So yeah, I prefer these um, just purely because of the size of them. I can get quite a lot of diamonds in them and everything else. And I do find that quite often all the diamonds line up very, very nicely on them, especially as I, I am somebody who does use my multi placements all the time or as much as I physically can. So yeah, so let's change the angle and let's see exactly what we can come up with. Oh, and before I forget, I always need to forget like when I'm doing the old talky talky bit and everything, what, what glue I'm using and everything sometimes. I always like, you could use the old double side tape on this. I like, at the moment, I am loving the um, B7000 glue. Absolutely love that stuff. So yeah, um, if you're not sure uh, what glues to use for plastics and glass and everything, B7000 glue absolutely fantastic stuff just make sure you give yourself plenty of time if you're going to be ordering it from aliexpress because um my last the one i've just literally received in the post i ordered that or in november and they actually hit uk customs on the 28th of november and it literally arrived a couple of days ago so yeah it just shows how long sometimes glues can take to get through customs so yeah so let's change the angle and let's see exactly what we can come up with for this. Right, so I have my plain white tray here. I'll show you an example of what I did um, the other day when I was just like messing around. And yeah, the square drills do fit on this quite nice on these quite nicely, these white trays, as you can see. Literally, they are the same width, six high as the tray doesn't give you like much to work with or nothing but it's still like i just did the mixed drills because i do have like a massive bag of mixed drills and everything so for for this i just messed around and just covered it with um mixed drills and i think, do think it's come up really nice obviously like the corners are quite awkward to get the drills on especially like the these ones but i do think it's still come out really nice so yes yeah, so that's the one i've already done so for this one, we are going to use our good old B7000 glue. Uh, this one is on its uh, last legs, so I will like use my new one. I don't know why everything's coming in like a dust. It's weird. But the thing I like about the bigger B7000 glue, it comes with the like the fine end in that's uh, actually inside. On like the smaller tubes, you put like a syringe thing on and they they do dry out really easy because you can't, it doesn't come with this bit which you can put inside. Like, so it stops it from drying out and everything. So yeah, I do love using my B7000 glue. I'm going to be using some of the colours from my last project, like the, the rhinestone ones. That says blue, pink, orange and here we go and i've picked out a green a yellow and this is the closest i can get to a leaf there they are basically like a greeny color so i think i'm going to do like a flowers go going along something simple nothing too hard and this tray stands up lovely which is always nice so i am going to start here I need some drills, don't I? That might be a good idea, Gemma. So what I'm going to do is, I think I'm going to have to grab a. Oh my God, I've got a tray here. Maybe I have to go and grab a couple of like extra trays or something. 
and I might have some here, I'm not sure. If not, I'll go and quickly grab some more trays. So I'm not doing like a million colour swaps. Um, with my yellow. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to quickly go and grab me a couple of like green trays or something. Just so I can um, do this. Alright, be back in just two secs. So I've grabbed myself some trays. Literally just grabbed a few so then I don't have to like the main colours like green, yellow and the leaves. I don't have to do like a million, like keep changing them over constantly even though they're the ones that be out like all the time. Let me... My stuff. The old's not big enough. Da -da. Right, so... Transfer this over to there's a few less of them. Green, I'll be using more. A bit green in that one. I'll put the leaves a bit dusty. Do you pull that tray and everything? You're not using that often, they get really dusty. Right. So, so the main ones are all set up, ready to go. And then I'll just use this one to another dusty tray. Even I just took it out of a bag. Let's put a little dot there. Boom. One yellow. And then... Shove some around. A few pinks. Like so, and just literally just go around the yellow one. The other one's here. So I'm going to go down up to here and we're going to put on a load of greens just for the line we just made. Really simple. Like I said, you can do any pattern you want. You can just cover the whole thing in one colour. You can just stick a load of uh, special shapes on it. You can do basically whatever you want. I need to change my works on this. Uh, let me just move it around a bit of... Um... So let's say we put in fresh wax because fresh wax isn't very good for B7000 because it's too sticky. I want 
one yard for the middle of our flower. And with like the B7000 glow, you can actually like move things around for a little bit, which is always good because you can see like, so I had to like move it around to line it up properly. Here we go. And down and up. And then back to the old greens. Like so. Right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to carry on with the old time lapse for a bit. And then so you can see the whole process about me sitting here talking for ages on end. Okay, so I'm gonna carry on. tray is done it's very very simple quick video this week i'm afraid but you know sometimes you know it's nice to do a small project i do like doing small projects hello viscous my cat just came in hence why the door just came open on its own <laughs> but yeah uh really do like these i think it's really cute and as i said before i use the old b7000 glue that stuff like cement when it dries it's still a little bit wet but yeah this stuff i do love that glue it is brilliant so yeah spares projects like the glass plastics and that do recommend the old b7000 glue you can get away with using double side tape as well uh, I find with double side tape though you need to seal it so that's the only downside to using double side tape you've got to seal the projects but with the B7000 glue because it's stuck on so hard you don't have to worry about sealing them but yeah really are cute and more what are cats doing viscous viscous where's she gone I don't know idea where she's gone viscous Gone. Come on. Can he come on? No? You're gonna come and say hello. Please guess. Come on then. Come on then. It's meowing. Come on. Come on then. Hello, hello, sweetheart. See, she's come to say hello. My family always say, I never see your cats because this one always hides. They, well, they both always hide when people come over. So, like, they can actually get to see them a little bit as well. So, yeah. Even though you guys can really, really see her bum, there you go. See a front view of her. But yeah, that's my, my eldest cat, Fiskers, for those of you who don't know. Hey, darling. 
but yeah my elder's cat so yeah so that is it for this week's video as you can see she's a proper mummy gal and it's a nice quick one for you guys so you want to try something little you can and we can jazz up our old trays any of your old trays really you can do even the old green boats you can jazz them up too so yeah doesn't matter what size trays you've got even if you've got your love heart shape ones i'll show you what i mean I do have some that I've got for the old giveaways. Them ones, those old love heart ones. Yeah, I've got them and everything like for when I do do more giveaways and everything. But yeah, so that is it for this week's video. Thank you ever so much for watching. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up if you like this video. Leave me a comment down below what you think of this week's spares idea. It is more of a simple one, easy one. That, you know, sometimes it is nice doing, like I said before, like it is nice doing a smaller project. Cat hair going everywhere. <laughs> oh, she's found the feathers. Let's see. She's a silly cat. So yes, that is, and um, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Sorry about this outro. I went a bit all hickledy pickledy and everything else. Saw her coming. I know some people like to see Viscus when she does make an appearance. Hey, Viscus. So, from me and my cat, Viscus, thank you ever so much for watching. And we shall see you all next time. Bye, everyone. You sweet girl, you sweet girl, ain't ya? Yes, you are.